I just saw uh, a couple of deer elk in the rut just heading down to the to Bear River. They'll probably track down there and be down there in a minute. Oh. Just heading into the equinox, first day of spring, tomorrow. I'm starting to miss winter. It's out here on Bear Ranch. And, we had a bit of snow this week, like three days. Um, but as you can see, it's melting pretty quickly. Um, down the river if we can pick up the the trail of those uh, that was a six point stag, bull stag six point, a big one so we're going to see if we can pick it up the snow's all melted back off the, the RC Crete is good. I'm just checking underneath the, the wooden uprights there. Have to put some more uh, sealer on them. A bit more sealer this summer. And the chimneys come being knocked loose by the uh, by the snow melting off the roof. I have to get up there and fix that. So we got the Alps. Fairly visible today. Blue sky. Um, as you can see, it's the uh, Tatayama and the Kita Alps, the northern Alps of Japan, right in front of our, our cabin, our log house. Situated here on Bear River and with Bear Mountain just behind it. Just behind us, on Bear Mountain. With the uh, the Japanese Northern Alps right in front of us. This place is crawling with wildlife. We got uh, we got elk and bear, squirrels, raccoons, foxes, and Bear River is. Um, yeah, brimming with, uh, we've got about 18 different varieties of steelhead trout, both introduced and native. Um, but the, yeah, the, the introduced uh, trout tend to eat <laughs> a lot of the native, unfortunately, and are taking over some great fishing to be had. Some of the best trout fishing in Asia, right here, right now, back doorstep. Peace out from Bear Mountain. Later.